Good morning. <clears throat> it is Thursday, the 20, what is it? The 27th? The 26th. <laughs> I have a new ink to try of the Shikiori line. You guys already, if you've been watching any of these videos, you know that I have three other colors. I have this green, the Taki, Taki, Tokiwa Matsu. And I have this um, gray, the Chushu. And I have this reddish color or brown, a reddish color, um, Okuyama. And I just got this blue Yamadori. So that looks really pretty. And I'm going to swatch it in my notebook. I like this. They always come with all these color codes for you to use. And they usually come with stickers. And this one does not have its sticker. Aww. There's a sticker on the box, so I might have to remove it and put it with it. But it usually has a sticker, stickers in it that <clears throat> has four removable stickers with the name on it. But for some reason, this one does not. So very pretty. So let me get in here to my book. Oh, I have to go get a Q-tip. Hang on, hang on. You're not far away. When I think I'm prepared for everything, I am apparently not. <laughs> All right, here we go. <sighs> Sorry about that. All right, and where's my pen for recording? This dries a lot quicker over here. And let's see. We are going to... Do this first. Oh, this is such a pretty, pretty blue. Oh, look at this color. Oh my gosh, I love it. Love it, love it, love it. Okay. So I'll set that there. And I will write what it is here. This one should dry pretty quickly. So this is the Sailor Shikiori line and it's the Yamadori. And it is the bottle. So these are the other colors. Those are the other two sailor colors right there. Um, so pretty, and I did want this color. This dries pretty quickly, I think. So I shouldn't have to worry about it. Um, then over here, I do the swatches and the ink splats. So here's the, sh the Tokyo Amatsu. Here's the Choshu. These are other ones. Here is the Okuyama. Um, I haven't done the dip pin yet because I'm waiting for my dip pin to arrive. This actually dries so fast when you're just doing a Q-tip. So let's do this color. So first is with my brush. And, oh, so gorgeous, right? So beautiful. Love it, love it, love it. All right, let's just, okay, and then I do the splat of ink. So I just get some in here and just drip it. That 
sufficient. Make sure that's cleaned out. Oh, blah, I just splattered on my glasses. <laughs> Water. Ugh, how annoying. Well, let's see if I can clean them and still be able to see. There. Oh my goodness. Ugh. Sometimes. <laughs> All right. Let's do this. So I just use a straw and just blow through it. Just look at how beautiful that is. Ugh, so pretty. <laughs> you can really make some fun designs, you know? Let's see if we can get this cleaned out. Okay, such a mess. All right, so I do like to, if I can, fill this um, up and put it in one of my um, fountain pens. And I do have a pen. I might put it in here. I think I just have a cartridge in a sailor. So let me see. Yeah, and look, it's almost empty, which is why I was having trouble writing with it. Because the cartridge is almost empty. So I just want to make sure I'm not going to flush this out. So just going to make sure it's cleaned out mostly from the ink. That'll give a chance for that to dry and then we can see um, if there's any pretty undertones in that color. Well, I, I don't want to get water in my thing, especially if I'm going to be um, doing a swatch, a writing swatch, but hmm. Maybe I'm gonna have to, even if I don't want to. Ooh, blue is so strong. I'll have to clean that out some more. Maybe if I just do like a dropper through it or something. Um, kind of flush it. I don't know if I can flush it out this way. I guess I can. Wasn't really how I wanted to do it. Probably ink pen people are gonna be, or fountain ink people are gonna be telling me that that was a crazy thing to do. <laughs> Probably it was. if we've still got some ink in here. Now that I dropped it, where'd it go? There it is. I should have really been more prepared, you guys. Sorry about that. Thank you for sitting here with me <laughs> while I did this nonsense. But I do think that took care of that, most of that ink that's in here. Because now it's like a purplish color, probably from the the blue getting in there. But you know what? I'm just going to load it, and I'm not going to worry about it. So, um, this is a Sailor converter. Let's give this a try. Okay, push it out. Got to get the air out so that it fills up all the way. I'm going to do it one more time. I'm not bringing it up through the nib just because since I changed the cartridge, I really don't want to um, mess up the, the nib, like get water into it as much as I might. 
So I do want to be careful. All right. I don't know if I'm going to be able to write with it and have it show. Ugh. And plus, I am obviously I have ink all over me. Not as bad as it could be, right? <laughs> all right, let's just see if we can dry our hands and cap this before I have any issues because that would be sad. Oh, there's a pretty sheen coming into this. Wonderful. Wonderful, wonderful. So that's the thing I love about this brand is that you get some of these really pretty um, colors coming through. And this is, looks like the color has come through just fine in this pen. So this is a Sailor and um, let me see exactly which one it is. This is my Sailor Lilac. It's the Prophet Junior, so we'll just do that this way. So I'll go like this Sailor Prophet. Junior. This is the lilac color, lilac body. And then the nib, I believe is a medium, medium fine, which I do love a lot. And it's also um, stainless steel. Oh, and I love this color. Oh my gosh. Well, I'm glad that came through. And it wrote all right as well. So I am certainly happy about that. Yeah. Oh my gosh. So pretty, you guys. I don't know um, if you can see. And then sometimes when you turn the page, it'll show over. But this one doesn't. Um, but, and I think I can do, without making a mess, make this the current, currently inked. <clears throat> so let's put that here. This is the Sailor Prophet Jr. Looks like it's about here. And we'll just, oh my gosh, I love this color so much. So we will write Sailor Prophet. Junior, Lilac, Nib, Medium, Fine. So I probably should get two more Sailor cartridge, uh, ink converters because I got two more Sailor pens that don't have ink converters and I'm just using cartridges in them from Sailor. So I would actually like um, to change that. So this is the Sailor Shikiori Yamadori. Beautiful, just beautiful. Oh my gosh, it's such a pretty color. Let me um, see if I can bring it up closer for you so you can get a better look at it. There's a, there's a little, there's a pretty um, sheen or shading, and it's really a, like a lilac or a purplish color in there, and it's just beautiful. All right, thanks guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed that. Bye.